Hi, so I'm going to be talking about Thomas Gallaudet. And so Thomas, his full name is Thomas Hopkins Gallaudet. He was born in Philadelphia on December 10th, 1787. Um, he was a really smart student, really smart, and was... Um, he attended Yale. He got into Yale at 14, and then graduated at the top of his class. Um, so about him, he met, he's always wanted to do good in his life, like help people. He met this girl named Alice um, Coswell, and she was deaf of his neighbor, um, Dr. Mason Cos Coswell, and his, his wife, Mary. And so... Um, he taught Alice words by writing them in the dirt and helping her know what those words were. And then, but he realized that there was no way, um, no way to teach Alice to educate her and what she was in to teach her and stuff. So he traveled to Europe to look for different teaching methods for deaf students. And he wanted to gain knowledge about deaf culture. He also, he met this man who wasn't willing to help him learn about it because they didn't think deaf culture was all that important and wanted all of them not to be there. Like, they, they didn't treat deaf people like normal citizens. They didn't want them to be there and everything. And so he was, his name was, um, Actually, no. he wasn't interested in sharing information about teaching in the deaf. And so he got nowhere until he met someone in Great Britain named Laurent, Laurent Clerk. And he followed him to Paris to learn more about the deaf manual communications. And he like loved it. And after he learned it from Laurent, he returned back to the United States to to help teach Nordeaf students. He then ended up um, going to New England and successfully had the funds to make a, a school for deaf students to teach them American Sign Language. And uh, the girl he was trying to help the one writing in the dirt, her name was Alice, and she was one of the first of seven students to attend that school. And that's all about my giant. Thanks.